Welcome to UI 101. If you're trying to unlink multiple parts that should have different materials, there are a few ways you can go about separating them. The best option is to always color block your model's parts in CAD before opening them in Keyshot. This is the easiest way to immediately start applying materials in Keyshot without worrying whether the correct parts are linked or unlinked. However, if you've already brought your model into Keyshot before color blocking, you can select your entire model or specific parts you'd like to unlink and then right click and select unlink from the material flyout menu. If necessary, you can then relink the parts you'd like to share materials by selecting the parts in the scene tree you'd like to link, right clicking, then selecting link from the same material flyout menu as before. Finally, the easiest and fastest way to unlink an already linked material is to simply locate the part in the scene tree and drag and drop your new material directly onto the item's location within the tree. This will automatically apply the material to that specific part alone and unlink that part for future material applications. When it comes to speed and accuracy, color blocking is always the fastest way to ensure the correct parts are linked or unlinked, but Keyshot's built-in features can significantly reduce the time and frustration that come with trying to fix these issues during the rendering process. Stay tuned, happy rendering, and we'll see you in the next one.